back. And other parts of the world learned long ago that delivery with an effervescent system with, you know, solubilizing everything that you wanted to take, make sure it was completely solubilized in liquid and tasted good before you ingest it, means the stomach does not have to do very much work. And also means that you, your um, body absorbs the materials much quicker and you're pretty sure it's getting all the materials that you intended it to get, whether it's aspirin, whether it's uh, acetaminophen, whether it's vitamins, whether it's minerals, um, pharmaceutical products. There's products overseas that are ranitidine and uh, famotidine and the, all, um, all types of products for your stomach to prevent ulcers. All the products in the U.S. are all made with little tablets because they're inexpensive and people can take them easily and they don't have to bother with putting them in water does not necessarily mean it's the best way to take the products. If you take a normal multivitamin tablets, everybody's seen the horse pills. Everybody swallows the horse pills. And when it goes into your stomach, if your stomach's not working correctly, I can leave this thing sit for 30 minutes and it, it will just sit there. So people tell me, oh, how come I, I can't take my multivitamins because my stomach upsets my stomach? Well, you have minerals and you have ingredients sitting on the bottom of your stomach and there's no way for that product to dissolve into the stomach. Sometimes it's carbon, um, uh, calcium carbonate. People are trying to get their calcium. Well, if the stomach isn't producing the correct amount of acid, there's no way the calcium carbonate is going to do anything <clears throat> except turn into a puddle of powder, go into your intestines, and most likely cause uh, constipation. If it does dissolve in your stomach, most likely you're going to have gas created by calcium carbonate and the same citric acid that's used with the other products because what it releases is CO2. So the effervescent system eliminates that. You take calcium ions, and you take calcium citrate, which is the best way to take calcium. So that's just one example. You have gummies, which you can take, you know, 10 grams worth of sugar and get your vitamins. Um, I wouldn't. They don't taste very good. They're not very stable. And you don't need the extra 10 grams of sugar. You can take a chewable and chew it. The problem with the chewable, you still have to have something in your stomach that's going to allow that chewable to fall apart. And it could sit in your stomach in one spot for typical emptying time of the stomach can be anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour and 15 minutes, depending on whether you had anything to eat. So you could just allow the minerals and the vitamins or whatever is in the chewable tablet, instead of being in a powder, it's in a tablet rather, it's in a powder sitting in the bottom of your stomach, irritating your stomach lining. Again, effervescent tablet, you don't have those issues. That's what they understand in the older generation countries in the world because they've been around for a few thousand years. We're a relatively young country.